then we can try and take the discussion towards livestock and uh, also this cash crops that he's talking about avocado and macadamia as well just to broaden the discussion on agriculture bit yeah uh, <coughs> i think my uh, the panelists have really mm -hmm. hit the nail on the head and i'll just summarize you see uh Dibal, we've been here before uh, Tom Boyer in the mid-1960s quipped insofar as distributive economics was concerned that uh, you can't distribute what you don't have. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And that's what we are being told here. The problems in the agricultural sector go way back to the 1970s. Uh, those who are old enough here and um, all of us are old enough here will remember the Karafu and the Chepkubes of the 1970s, uh, you fast track and come uh, forward the, the maize and uh, sugar importation, uh, you kill the sugar industry and you kill the maize industry and you import and there are specific people who are given uh, those letters. We know of the National Cereals and Produce Board issuing those letters this particular candidate was branded so well you have to give him credit remember he was a minister for agriculture and he's not addressing the very issues which made him be removed from the ministry of Ag agriculture and basically that is the brokers uh Debal, you usually talk of budgeted corruption you have one here basically you are saying this money is there and the cartels and the middlemen they are the ones who will get it Galana Kulalu, as uh, my colleagues have said, is a good example. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Well, just on a lighter note, we have that interesting editorial cartoon today by uh, Victor Ndula there. Uh, and uh, if we may just uh, bring it to the fore, uh, we have him saying in the next 100 days, you can see them now with their manifesto, except for David Wa Wa Wahiga Maure, who has not uh, unleashed his uh, manifesto as it is right now. The director may just uh, take the full screen of it. You can see the uh, professor looking at that particular detour cartoon. <laughs> the next hundred days. Is Ruto, Ruto has been dubbing? You know, uh, <laughs> 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 they normally say dubbing. Uh, yeah, the notes of Raila Odinga. Uh, he's shaking uh, them. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, taking some. And uh, Wahiga wa, 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 also seems to be yeah. 